A man from Schertz is facing up to five years in federal prison for pleading guilty to pointing a laser at the pilot of a San Antonio Police Department helicopter. That is a federal crime. That laser hit the eyes of that pilot, causing him not to be able to see his gauges properly. It's an issue that we've reported on with our very own case at 12 pilots over the years. And again, it's a federal crime. Tiffany Huertas talks to a pilot who explains exactly what they experience when someone decides to play dangerously. The pilot is using all their senses. Hamid Avzal has been a flying instructor since 1981. He says pointing a laser at a pilot can be unsafe. Especially on takeoff and landing, it's a crucial time and they don't have that much time, that much altitude to maneuver with and stuff like that, so it could be very, very critical. But what do pilots actually experience? Just like a camera flash, if you get a, a laser that sort of flashes your eye, you could actually get an after image that may blur the vision for a few minutes. And that can be dangerous while operating an aircraft, says Dr. Daniel Johnson from UT Health San Antonio. The likelihood of a permanent damage from that that's gonna last for a prolonged period of time is low, but it could temporarily stun your vision. He says the effects lasers have on pilots depends on the strength of the device. So high power lasers can damage you know, tissue, they can damage skin, they can damage the vision. However, the toys that, that people use typically are below the threshold where we worry about causing permanent damage to the eye. Johnson says damage to the eyes also depends on how close the laser is when pointed. The farther that you are from the source of the laser, the more the laser light gets diffused, and so it actually gets weakened. And so even higher power lasers at farther distances, like over a thousand feet, typically aren't likely to produce long-term damage. Dr. Johnson says, if you're exposed to a laser, do not stare at the laser directly. You should get your eyes examined immediately to see if there are any issues. There are instances um, of people rubbing their eyes significantly after lasers and basically causing corneal abrasions. You irritate the skin on the surface of the cornea and that can actually blur the vision as well. That can take some time to heal and that's gonna be painful. Now pointing a laser at an aircraft is against the law. Offenders could face up to five years in prison and up to a $250,000 fine. Myra.